Hey guys, what's going on? Drax here, back again. Oh my goodness. Right mouse button. We're on fire. We're on fire. Oh, I think we're good. Hey guys, what's going on? Drax here, back again with another episode for you guys today. Today we're starting a new series of Subnautica. Hope you guys are having a good day today. My day is going pretty darn well. In emergency situations, you have been issued this personal data assistant. The interface visible now will organize your inventory, display currently available construction blueprints, and holds other valuable information. Please take a moment to familiarize yourself with it. All right, there we go. We're taking care of Attention. um detecting increased local radiation levels. Trend is consistent with ongoing degradation of the Aurora's dark matter drive core due to damage sustained during collision. Continuing to monitor. All right. Bionetics connected, life pod connected, performing situation. We are playing on survival, so we have food and water that we have to take care of and our health. Um, let's go ahead and left mouse button. All right, let's check this out. Uh, three hours since planet fall, life pod condition, uh, uncharted ocean planet, oxygen, nitrogen, atmosphere, water contamination high. Reference information has been added to the PDA and will advance. Okay, good luck. All right, so we've got quite a few things here. I have been following um, Subnautica for quite a while, actually, and uh, am, am absolutely in love with this game personally. So I, I can't really wait to uh, to play. So we got a couple of flares, we got some filtered water, and we got some nutrition blocks. Um, looks like we need to kind of repair some stuff. So I need a welder that I'm not really sure how to use yet. A medical fabricator, let's take that. Um, and then damage communications relay fabricator. All right, all right. Uh, don't need to be in that. Let's go ahead and go out the bottom. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, yeah, so we kind of look around here. We swim in the ocean. And, uh, ooh, break limestone. All right. I got copper ore discovered. Is essential component to all powered equipment. Your probability of survival has increased by 7.6%. Oh, yeah. Quartz. Quartz is cool. Ooh, what is this? Uh, sea glide fragment. Okay. Uh, what? Oh, I can just dig. Okay. Um,. Life pods are equipped with fabricator program to construct tools and render organic, substantial substance. Oh, remain. swim to surface. I'm swimming. Ten seconds. All right, we're good on oxygen now. Uh, there's a little, what are you, like a pooper guy or something? I'm not really sure. Um, metal, okay, and salt deposit. So yeah, uh, I've been following this game for quite a while. I've actually covered it once on my channel for just a little bit. And uh, definitely look forward to checking out some of the things they've added because they have added a lot in the uh, time since I last played. And I very much look forward to that. So I'm just kind of picking up some stuff. I don't have a whole lot of experience. Like I said, though, um, I, I've played very, very little. So I, I'm looking forward to doing this Let's Play. If you guys are also looking forward to this Let's Play, please do me a favor. Hit that like button. And subscribe if you are new to the channel. Uh, automated short range distress signal failed. Life pod contaminations relay. Of the drive core Battery. May cause a quantum detonation. Calculating risk assessment. Death by malnourishment. 7%. By physical injury. 11%. By exposure to radioactive crash site materials. 19%. <laughs> if the drive core is breached. Probability of death increases to sixty-five percent. A pipe. So, uh, b basically, what they're telling me is I'm not uh, likely to survive here, um, in any way, shape, or form. Where is this crash powder? I want to make a welder. Um, and it says crash powder, but I don't necessarily see that uh, in there. So let's go back out. We kind of take a look at our inventory. Um, we are getting kind of full. Um, crash powder. All right. So I'm going to go ahead and get some titanium. I'm assuming these are just limestone is like 
a random assortment. So that is lead. I think we got some titanium, some copper. So quite the um, array of items that you could possibly get in here. So if you guys have any tips or tricks for me while playing this game, I would love them. Uh, it really would probably help me out. Emergency. Ten seconds of oxygen. Ten seconds of oxygen remaining. So we definitely can't go very far from the surface at this point. And I think there's even stuff to, like, kind of, you know, continue that on if you wanted to. Um, not really sure. I'm, I'm, this is all, like, best guess at this point uh, because I haven't played in so long. All right, so let's come over here. We'll grab that medal, and then we're going to come back over to our ship. Get our oxygen back. There's another piece of metal. Let's go ahead and grab this piece of metal as well. All right, and come up to the surface and board the escape pod. All right, so we kind of look at resources. We have titanium, titanium, titanium. So that gives us quite a bit of stuff. Um, now we were looking at making the welder weren't we? Uh, crash powder. I don't know what crash powder is. Waterproof locker we can make. There's a beacon, water, um, crash powder, crash powder. I don't, I just don't see what that would be. All right, let's get out of this. And then we need to empty our inventory just a little bit because I know we're pretty limited on what we can carry. Right, mouse button switches it. So that's good to know. We don't really need that anymore. Um, Warning. Local radiation readings exhibit characteristics consistent with total degradation of the Aurora's dark matter drive core. A quantum detonation will occur with a probability of 85.5%. Advise observing a one kilometer safety range. All right, so one kilometer safety range. That sounds good. Uh, copper wire, benzene, lead, all this stuff. Um, it, where's the welder? There it is. Don't see crash powder. Eat something. Okay, uh, we need to eat something. Um, open the container, and then we can get out one of these. Uh, yep, switch container, and then we can eat. Awesome. Okay, well, we ate. Perfect. Uh, let's go back down. And I'm guessing we need to do a little bit of exploration around here uh, just to kind of see. Because I'm assuming crash powder, since I'm not finding it, uh, you know, that'll be something that we just kind of come across. Ooh, what is this? A creature egg. Okay, that sounds cool. Those are definitely new from the last time I played. Um, come back through here. Man, this is, this is crazy. We need to be very careful, though, uh, because we have, like, 12 seconds of oxygen left. Emergency. 10 seconds of oxygen remaining. I'm going, I'm going, I'm going, I'm going, I'm going. Ah, uh, breach. Awesome, 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 awesome. Okay, so can we climb up that? Oh, we sure can. All right, so we can go in this way as well. Um, so there's other equipment in here that we could use too. So there's a scanner, which we need a battery. So let's see, electronics, battery. Um, no, that's a power cell. This is a battery. Two acid mushrooms. So we check this out. We can get a couple of those. So let's get those back. I need to get used to that uh, not hitting escape. Seismic readings suggest a quantum detonation has occurred in the Aurora's drive core. The central right. dark matter reactor will reach a supercritical state. In T minus ten, nine, uh -oh. eight. That doesn't seven, sound good. Six, five, um, four, let's go up here. Three, two. Something gonna happen? Oh, that's not good. Oh, that's that can't be good. That cannot be good at all. Explosions have happened. Explosions have happened. All right, our Geiger counter is apparently going way up. Let's see if we can't uh, turn down the the sound just a little bit here. Let's go down to 35, and we'll turn that down to about 60. And that'll just kind of get it a little bit quieter. Okay, so we have a scanner now. Um, 
So searching, can I can I scan you? Scan. 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 Can I can I scan? Scan. Uh, medical box, first aid kit. All right. So we'll come out here. Is there a bunch of stuff we can scan out here? Scan. What is this? Air sac. Okay. What are you? Uh, air sac added entry. All right. So I guess there's there's stuff we gotta scan. Um, oh, there was something we couldn't pick up a minute ago. What was that? Um, oh goodness, where is uh, oh there it is right there. Oh, there's one right here too. Look at how beautiful this game is. This is awesome. Okay, sea glide fragment, sea glide fragment overall discovered. Oh, sea guy had added to. That sounds pretty cool actually. So we've unlocked the sea glide now. Oh, Gasopod. All right. What's up, Gassy? How's it going, brother? Let's go ahead and uh, scan this guy. We only got 10 seconds of oxygen left. We're pretty close to the top, though, so we should be all right. Up, 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 up. All right. Gasopod added to Encyclopedia. Very cool. All right. Go back up into here, and then we can check out, I'm assuming, our Encyclopedia is um, F11 to take a screenshot. I can do that. Data downloads, technical equipment. Um, there's, oh, vehicles. We can make that sea glide now. How do we do that? Uh, personnel, equipment. Um, is that, oh, sea glide. There we go. Battery, lubricant, and copper wire. So we have copper wire. And then if I get out of that and come over here, we can probably craft another one of these batteries. Electronics. The sea glide. I think that's like a little propulsion system, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, sea glide a lubricant. 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 Where's my lubricant? Um, I don't. I don't know where the lubricant is made, uh, to be perfectly honest with you. Uranium, synthetic fibers, benzene, magnesium, bleach, silicon, rubber, creep vine clusters. All right, so we might have to do a little bit more exploring before we get uh, into anything else there. I'm just kind of looking around a little bit. Um, I think I can grab some of these fish. Oh, cooked air sac. All right. So I can eat these guys, I assume? Oh, no, I let them go. All right, um, if I hit tab, can I just eat them raw? Food nine uses primal memory filled with oxygen filled with air. Oh, no, come back. You were free for a moment. Oh, I ate it and I got oxygen. That is really cool. That is super neat. All right, um, so what else is around here? What is this thing? I don't know what it is. Oh, there it is. There it is. Hoverfish. Hoverfish. Uh oh, go up, go up. There's a, a bioreactor fragment. I don't know what a bioreactor is. That Aurora is definitely a beat up ship uh, that we will have to check out. Bioreactor. Let's scan it. Scan it. Uh, all right, so we got to find another one of those fragments. Um, pick up the quartz, uh, salt, awesome. Okay, and I think there's metal around there. Can you scan the metal? Metal salvage. It didn't give us anything. Oh, what is down here? Oh, check this out. All right, maybe we should go up for oxygen and then we can come back down. A little guy like swam away from, uh, swam away from us really, really fast. All right, so we come back down here. What is that guy doing? He's like digging. All right, um, nothing there. You can't scan that. Um, another medal. I like the medal. A cargo. Luggage bag. Um, no, let's go back to number one. More metal. Inventory full. Okay, so I can't pick up any more metal. What is that? Oh, I can't scan it. Emergency. 
10 seconds of oxygen remaining. All right, so I think we got something good there. We got luggage. I don't really know what luggage is. Oh, oh we're dying. Huge disaster. All right, so we're getting kind of far from our ship. So let's go back and let's see. Luggage. Um, just a luggage bag and a creature egg. Okay, so we got the creature egg as well. Wonder, I don't, I, I was able to go up to that guy and just kind of look at him. He didn't attack me or anything. It's good to know. Look at this creepy hole right there. That's scary. All right, where's, um, oh, it's right above us. I was going to say, where's our ship? We've lost our ship. Okay. Um, let's see. Number four. Luggage. Luggage. Do I have to set the luggage on the ground? That's it. That that's all you can do is just put down luggage. Can I scan the luggage? Nothing. <laughs> all right. Um, kind of confused on that matter, but you know, hey, we'll we'll deal with it. Uh, so let's go ahead and do I have? I do have another bladder fish. So the bladder fish gave us a new recipe, I do believe. Resources, uh, water. There we go. Let's drink some water. And then if we look through here in this scanner, there's an air bladder, a survival knife, a flashlight. Oh, we can make a flashlight. Let's go ahead and make a flashlight. Glass. All right. Got that. A flare, a habitat builder, a computer chip, and a battery. Let's see, battery and a computer chip. Um, can't make that yet, but there's, there's a knife. A silicon rubber... All right, so I don't know how to make silicon rubber. Let's see. Uh, creep vine seed clusters. All right. So we probably have something to go towards here. Um, let's put away the lead. Let's put away... Oh, let's use the filtered water. Let's use the health pack. Let's eat the fish. Um, we have a flashlight. We can put that away. We can put that away. Um, I could use some more storage. So let's see. Is there a... An option for a waterproof locker. All right, cool. Let's uh, let's back out of that. Number three, locker, locker. <laughs> All right, escape pod. <coughs> let's see. Um, okay, it just floated away. All right, open storage. So it's just got a little bit of room, but it's big enough to hold like the big items that we have. So I'm okay with that. Locker. Edit label. Stuff. All right. There we go. Okay. So there's the stuff over here. And I do believe this is where any seed vine creep clusters would be. All right. Pick up the salt deposit. Uh, let's scan this. Oh, wait. No, that's not the scanner. That the sea glide. Uh, oh, oxygen. Oh, we already got the sea glide. So I got titanium for that? That's new. All right, I can deal with that. So do we get more titanium for scanning this? Oh, this is a solar panel fragment. All right. That seems cool. What is that thing over there? All right, um, is this another creature egg? Mobile vehicle bay. Not sure what that is. Let's come over here. There's some crazy noises over here. Solar panel fragment. Ouch, what is attacking me? Uh, what is attacking me? What is that thing? It's a stalker? What is a stalker? It looks like it's stuck in that hole. That guy's playing with metal creep vines. Let's scan the creep vine. Alright, creep vine. I think... Oh, should I pick up this metal? I think I should. Let's pick it up. I got it. Alright. A stalker. Alright, scan you. Uh-uh. No, you can't get me. I'm too fast for you, creep vine. All right, I just picked up a whole bunch of stuff. Uh, I think I, I think I should get out of here. Emergency. Ten seconds of oxygen remaining. All right, we're going, we're going, we're going. We're at the top. No problem. Inventory full. I can't pick up that metal. All right. I can't pick up that metal either. Come here, air sac. Got you. 
Is there any more? I could use more water. Water, water everywhere, but not a drop to drink. Uh, inventory full. Oh, I can't pick him up. All right, let's get up here. Into the wild blue yonder. All right. So we check out substance water. We'll get the air sac made. Cool. Uh, and then we can make silicon rubber. And then I believe with that, uh, if we kind of come off here and get a couple more of those acid mushrooms, or maybe even this copper wire, maybe? I don't know. Uh, let's get that. Uh, plus 20 water. Plus 20 water. Okay. Let's grab that as well. Fabricator, personal systems, survival knife. So we now we can defend ourselves from those crazy creatures that we just came across. Uh, scanner, welder, I still need magnesium. Lubricant. Lubricant. Is it lubricant or lubricant? It's lubricant. Uh, okay, and then what do we have here? It's O2 tank. Oh, glass. Yeah, we can make that. Can make some more O2 tanks. That actually looks really cool. So let's see. Let's see that now. Um, pipe, thermometer, air bladder, survival knife, welder, magnesium, or habitat builder, computer chip, and battery. Computer chip and battery. Okay, computer chip, uh, battery, computer chip, uh, quartz, and all right, so we don't have enough for that yet. Um, but we do have some cool stuff. Let's let's check it out. Battery, lubricant, O2 tank. So that changed our oxygen rating from 45 to 75. So that's got to be pretty good. Oh, there's another thing for us to scan. Let's check this out. Come over here. Sea glide fragment. All right, so probably just some more titanium from that. And then giant coral tubes. Common coral sample. All right, so we got some common coral sample. Are you a common coral sample? You are. All right. Um, and I know table coral is slightly different, but I don't remember exactly where it is. So let's hit the air here and we get our stuff. I'm pretty sure it was on, like, these, these beds. Oh, maybe that's it right over there. All right. Let's get the quartz, because quartz is good, I think. And then we've got these right over here. Uh, oh, table coral. Yep. Thank you. Ah, uh, give me that. Giveth to me the thing. All right, so now we should probably be able to head back. There's a lot of that. Ooh, salt. All right. Got some more acid mushrooms if we needed them. Um, just kind of looking around here. Beacons back over this way. Oh, what is that little thing? Oh, hello, Gary Fish. You're cool. I'm going to let you go, though. I don't really need any food. All right, so continuing on. Hmm. All right, so I wonder if we can get this thing crafted now. Um, maybe not, because I don't think I have everything I need, but I think I'm close. So we needed a computer chip, uh, computer chip, and silver ore. And so I think the silver ore is the one thing I haven't gotten yet. Uh, let's see. I'm just kind of looking through a scanner. Uh, I think the Habitat Builder is like the first thing we want to get and the laser cutter requires a diamond. I don't think we can get that. Um, let's see. Fins, two silicon rubber. Can I do that? I cannot. I cannot. I apparently made all the silicon rubber that I grabbed. Um, is that true? I guess it is. A bunch of coral samples, I'll tell you that much. All right, so I might actually want to make another... Oh, sea glide. There it is. We have a sea glide. Sweet. All right, let's check this out. Sea glide number four. Oh, we're looking at it. Check it out. Oh, yeah, we move so much faster. Oh, it has a light. That is cool. And look at that little holographic display on the top. That is really neat. All right. Well, that's where we're going to wrap up today's episode, guys. Episode one, and we have a sea glide. I think we're doing pretty good. 
Uh, but, uh, yeah, we're going to wrap up there, guys. If you enjoyed, please let me know. Hit that like button, and we will see you in the next one. Oh, God, what is that? <laughs>